Could this be the tablet of the future? Lenovo has just released this two-in-one tablet that features a stunning new touchscreen keyboard. Called the Yoga Book, it can turn a touch-sensitive screen into a full-size keyboard at the tap of a button. The keyboard can also learn your typing mistakes and can automatically correct them. The Lenovo Yoga Book also has another first of its kind. It features an ink stylus that lets you write on paper as well as digitally all at the same time. The Chinese manufacturer is hoping these new features will turn on consumers to an otherwise declining tablet market. Uh, but it, it's a tablet with a full keyboard, uh, so I think it's almost a new form factor, but it's, it's, uh, but it's a category that uh, I think this year will be probably something in the range of, uh, when we look at the worldwide market, in the range of 20, 20 something million with a big growth, uh, 80, almost 80% 80 growth compared to last year. The Lenovo Yoga Book will run on two different operating systems, Android and Windows. The company said these new products were three years in the making. And Lenovo's COO also rejected criticisms that this new product could cannibalize some of its own laptop sales. No, I really don't, don't think that uh, he's addressing two different uh, uh, customer segment, uh, it's uh, addressing two different uh, usage uh, model. I think uh, they can even be complementary uh, each other in the sense that uh, one, it's uh, when I look at yoga book, it's really a tablet. Tablet sales have shrunk by 12.3 percent year over year in the second quarter of 2016, while the two-in-one sector has seen growth. Whether consumers will want to put pen to screen is yet to be seen. At the IFA Consumer Show in Berlin, I'm Phil Hahn for CNBC. Hey CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you're going to find videos packed with all of the information that you need to be smarter about your finances. You can subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me or the eye right here to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.